action both for the listeners but also for the disc jockeys. Well, some called it the heart of the community. A century-old sawmill in the mountain town of Camino shut down today. And when it did, it put 160 mill workers out on the unemployment line. As News 10's George Warren shows us, the company says it wasn't just the poor economy that led to the shutdown. After more than a century of operation, the Sierra Pacific sawmill in Camino fell silent. The last log went through the saw blade at 6 o'clock in the morning. One of the blades that Scott Anderson had kept sharp for nearly 25 years. It's uh, pretty devastating to see this happen. Anderson is among the 160 mill workers losing their jobs. To find a replacement income that Sierra Pacific provides is, um, in El Dorado County is going to be very difficult. The slowdown in the housing market has hurt sawmills, of course. But Sierra Pacific says environmental litigation has also choked off the supply of trees from the national forest. Due to litigation on the national forest and the lack of timber supply, coupled with the failing housing market, this has truly been the perfect storm. So with all those conditions tied together, it's very difficult to operate a business. Well, I'm, I'm disturbed about it. it. It's a thing that's been there all my life. I have never seen the mill deck empty. We're not managing our forest, and, and that's the cause of this mill being shut down. The California Forestry Association estimates the 160 layoffs at the mill will indirectly affect 360 other jobs in the Camino area. It's been a lifeblood of this community for a long, long time, long time, and I'm hating to see it shut down, but I can understand why they're doing it. They call the decline in both supply and demand the perfect storm. With a bit of optimism, Sierra Pacific will keep the mill intact in mothballs with the hope the storm will pass. In Camino, George Warren, News 10. Well, local Congressman Tom McClintock points out that Camino now joins Quincy and Sonora as mountain towns that have recently lost sawmill jobs because of environmental litigation over force thinning operations around Northern California. A federal bank